Hello everybody, this is Keith from Crypto Coin Mindset. I hope you're doing well today. In today's video, we've got a lot to cover. We're going to be going over the Revolut money managing app. If you haven't heard of this app in the United States, it's probably because it is the UK's fastest growing money management app. And I'd say several months ago, it finally made it over here to the United States. And in today's video, we're going to review that app, what it's all about, talk to you about its features, show you how to get it set up. Once you get the app set up, it's going to allow you to do a whole bunch of things, including having access to over 28 different fiat currencies. And if you upgrade to their platinum or metal card, you'll also have access to currently five of the largest cryptocurrencies by market cap. Also, we're going to review one of this app's latest features, which is Revolut Junior, which is basically targeting teaching your kids how to manage money. So there's a lot of things to cover here. So let's get to it. All right, everybody, welcome back. Like I said, in today's video, we're gonna be discussing Revolut. It's the UK's fastest growing tech company where they give you the ability to manage your money right on your phone. They also give you the opportunity to access cryptocurrency and they give you the chance to teach your kids how to manage money. That's a lot of stuff, we're gonna cover it, we're gonna go through how to set it up, the whole nine with regard to Revolut. And if you stick around at the very end of this video, we're going to show you some other ways to make money in the cryptocurrency space, some passive income opportunities. So stay tuned for that. But let's take a quick look here at Revolut. They allow you to open up a personal or a business account with Revolut. I'm going to assume most of the people on here want to do a personal account. So that's what we're going to kind of go through today. And when we go through the actual setup, that's what we're going to be setting up. Basically, this Revolut app on your phone allows you to access a bunch of different fiat currencies. And with just a deposit of $20, they'll actually allow you to have a free account. So no fees and they'll send you a debit card in order to access your money. You can actually hold and exchange over 28 different fiat currencies so over 28 different world currencies which is great especially if you're transferring money across the world to different people they also have the ability to access so now you got an ATM card uh, but you know how it is you go to your bank you're using the ATM cards and they fee you to death I can't stand the fact that you actually have to pay to get access to your own money well with Revolut you can find up to 55,000 surcharge free ATMs across the globe. And I'm sure that that's expanding all the time. And that's huge being able to access your money without the fees. They have a lot of other features that are built into this app, which includes stuff like instant spending notifications, budgeting, and basically they have what's called vaults. Uh, so you can actually put your money away in like a savings account. And just like you can do with a lot of your current banking situations, they'll round up for you. So you, let's, you make a purchase with your credit card, it comes out to uh, 1050, they'll round up for you if you set that in your uh, settings and round it up to $11, and then that extra 50 cents will go in the vault. And that's just an easy way to save money. So they also give you the ability to split the tab with other people. So like if you charge something on your card, you can then send other Revolut users the bill, if you would, and they can actually split that entire tab. So it's just an easy way to split the bill. So the person who the waiter, waitress, uh, whoever it is, maybe let's say at the restaurant doesn't have to do it five, six different ways. You can have one person pay the bill and then boom, it's easy peasy to get your money back and like with other things you can actually request money from other users and they also allow you to set up recurring payments much like you can do with your current bank account you can actually go in there and set up uh, a monthly bill to be paid your your phone bill your electric bill whatever 
Now, we're going to be focusing on the U.S. version of this. And with that in mind, any funds deposited are held by the Metropolitan Commercial Bank, which is a member of the FDIC and insured up to $250,000. Some of the additional features with that is you have 24-7 customer support and you can freeze and unfreeze your card. So if for whatever reason you lose your, your credit card that goes along to your account, you can get on your app, freeze the, the card, and then you, you go through your pants pocket, you find it, you can unfreeze your card and you're back in business. That is a huge feature. There is direct deposit and they claim that if you use the direct deposit, you can actually get your funds up to two days early. Now, honestly, I don't use the direct deposit feature with Revolut, but I'm thinking I might give it a shot. And when I do, I'll update you on that. Okay, so let's take a quick look at what plans are available basically with Revolut. There is the free plan, like I mentioned above. You know, with the deposit of $20, they'll send you your credit card uh, in the mail, and I'm going to be doing an unboxing of that in this video as well uh, for mine that just came in. And that costs nothing, no fees per month. Basically, you can spend in over 150 different currencies at the interbank exchange rate. You can exchange up to 28 different fiat currencies to the tune of $6,500 USD per month without any additional fees. And you can access a no-cost ATM. Again, there's over, according to them, 55000 to the tune of withdrawals up to $300 USD per month. That's the free version, the standard version. Then you have access to the premium version, which is $9.99 per month USD. You get all those same features as the standard version, with the exception that your ATM withdrawal limit, instead of being $300 per month, is $600 per month. You also get Global Ex Express Delivery, Priority Customer Support, a premium card with exclusive designs, which we'll show you in a minute, disposable virtual cards which is actually really good if you're making purchases online which a lot of people are doing these days with a lot of the lockdowns across the world you don't want somebody being able to get your actual credit card number and basically stealing your identity and in, in essence your money so you can use a disposable virtual card and you have complete access to that for this 9.99 per month if you do a lot of traveling, there's lounge key pass access and uh, free lounge passes for you and a friend if your flight is delayed for more than one hour. Okay, so let's look at the different products that are available to you with the Revolut wallet. Obviously, money transfers. So you can basically send money all around the world at the interbank exchange rate. You can transfer money in 28 different currencies. Next, you can send and request payment. And again, if you're looking to save money, they have a great vault feature. Again, they can round up, much like you can do right now. So again, 1050, round up to 11 automatically, and that 50 cents goes into the vault and it continues to save. You can also set up recurring payments to the vault. So if you wanna set aside, I wanna save $25 a week or whatever. So every week it automatically transfers the money to the vault and one of the features I do like about this is that you can create what they call a group vault. So if there is like a group of you trying to maybe save for a vacation or a shared expense or maybe a gift for your parents, all the kids trying to save money in, in one location, you can create a group vault and then everyone can contribute to that vault. I think that is a huge feature. And finally, you can budget. It, it gives you the ability uh, to basically plan your budget throughout the course of the month, set goals and, and be able to track your expenses in real time. So as soon as you create a transaction, it shows up in your budget. So you're able to see it right then and there as it happens. You can see all your spending basically at the click of a button. And I'll tell you what, that's a great feature, especially when you're trying to learn how to save money and manage your money better. All right, now that we've gone over exactly what Revolut is, we'll get into how to set it up on the app on your phone. But before we go there, I'd like to take a minute to ask you, if you haven't already done so, to hit the subscribe button and tick that bell icon. And with that bell icon, now you have to hit all uh, to make sure you get all the videos as we put out great information about cryptocurrency and everything kind of going on in the space. So if you could take a moment now to do that, I'd greatly appreciate it. All right, let's get into setting up the app. 
So once you download the app, and again, there's going to be a link in the description below to show you how to get to Revolut. So you make sure you go into the right place. You don't take part in a, any phishing scams or anything like that. Uh, so make sure you got the right link. And again, that's going to be in uh, the description of the video below here. There'll be a link to take you over to the appropriate place, whether you have an iPhone or an Android. Go ahead and download the app. Once you do so, you're going to come to the legalese portion of the app. As they put right here, it's boring but important. So go through that and then hit the agree button. And then once you do that, it's going to ask you to add money. Now, the reason it asks you to add $20, or obviously you can add more than $20, is it wants you to add $20 as part of the free account in order to actually have them ship your free visa card to you so click the add money and you'll be taken into the next step now once you go to add money and in this case i added a, the minimum of 20 dollars. it asks you to connect your bank card so your visa master debit card whatever to the revolut wallet once you do that you click add money and it will begin to process the transaction and then you click the one more thing button and it's gonna ask you to verify your identity. So basically they do do KYC. It will automatically figure out who you are depending on the phone number because will ask you to enter your phone number when you put the initial information into the app uh, and then it walks you through the process of enabling your camera so you can actually take a picture of the necessary documents so your driver's license passport etc so enable the camera and go through the kyc process so once you have all the kyc complete it's then going to ask you when do you want to receive your card by so basically, it's going to give you some options depending on the plan you have, whether it's the free plan or the premium plan, or if you want to pay extra to get the card in by a certain date. I opted for the free plan with the free delivery. So as of the time of recording this, it was approximately two weeks for me to receive the card. So keep that in mind depending on how soon you want the card and to be able to access and use the money on the Revolut wallet. And then you'll, uh, once you accept whichever one you want, bam, your card is on its way. I like that graphic, it's kind of cool. And then it'll prompt you to see if you want to take that card and attach it to Google Pay. And that's up to you if you want to do that. Honestly, I'm not a fan of Google Pay, so I, I didn't do that. And then it's going to ask you if you want to set up a vault. So let's walk through how to set up a vault, but you can skip this process if you want. You can always go back to it later. There's a, uh, a prompt inside the app to be able to do that. And here's all the great features of the vault uh, that we kind of uh, went over earlier, including the uh, group vault, which I thought was pretty cool. So when you go to set up your vault, you'll have an option. Do you want to do a regular vault or a group vault? In this case, I'm doing a regular vault because why not, right? And so you name your vault when you start. And so I'm gonna pop in the name of my vault here. And there you go. My personal vault is set up. And then now it prompts you to see if you want to put in recurring funding. You can skip that, which I did, because that's not what I want to do right now. And then here you go. It, you have options. You can fund it. You can edit it. You can share this vault with other people, etc. Pretty cool feature right at the tip of your fingers here in the Revolut wallet. All right, as promised, here's the unboxing for the credit card. As you can see, it comes in a nice quality envelope. We're going to rip that open. And here we go. It's uh, another nice quality envelope with the Revolut right on there. And it's kind of, I like the way it opens. It opens at both ends. One end, you have the card itself, which is high quality metal card. Nice. And uh, the other side gives you information about the card, which is basically you can uh, check your PIN at any time with your app. Revolut works with over 130 different currencies and it can be converted automatically into the local currency. And obviously we're going to have to go register this card and activate it on our app. So let's go do that. All right, let's go activate the card. So we'll go to cards. And it says activation required. So we'll go activate card. And we'll enter. 
match with a card number. So hang on while I pause the video and do that. So as we move on, let's look at some of the dashboard options that you have here in the app. Now, I'm not going to go into all of these in great detail because once you download the app, you'll be able to poke through these on your own and obviously set up your app to look and feel and operate the way you would like it to do so. So, but you have the option and on your dashboard, you'll see all your accounts. You'll be able to find a rates converter so you can find the conversion rates between different fiat currencies. Obviously, if you have a vault, you'll be able to access it from here. You'll be able to create a watch list, which basically will allow you to create a watch list pair. So let's say you're you're looking to convert your US dollars into something else. You'd find whatever that other currency is and click that and it will create a watch list for you. So when it gets to whatever rate it is that you're looking for to create that change in currency, you'll be alerted and you can create your transfer. And just to note, the top cryptocurrencies are also here that you can be alerted on as well. Bitcoin, Litecoin, Ethereum, etc. Now, one of the other great features of Revolut is it gives you payment options. So you can do bank transfers, uh, you could split a bill like we talked about, which is a great feature, create reoccurring payments or schedule payments and create a payment link. So if you want to receive payments, that kind of thing. You also can connect your bank account to this and you can see there's a section here to add your bank account and you can see what it looks like to add in a payment and estimate out your budget. You can set up a budget and you can do it by category, merchant, whatever you need. There's obviously a notification tab, so if you get any notifications from them. And also you can invite friends to join you with Revolut Wallet. You can get your access link right here. You just copy it and you can send that via email, text message, however you want to do it. Now back in the beginning of this video, we mentioned to you that the Revolut app had just recently launched a feature that allows children of users to learn how to manage money. This money managing portion of their app is called Revolut Junior, and we highlighted it on our blog, as you can see here. Basically, this feature is attached to a parent's account, and it allows kids ages 7 to 17 to learn how to manage their own funds, obviously with the parent's oversight. This Revolut Junior app has all the features, pretty much, of an adult app, including a new Revolut Junior card for the kids to use. This app is designed with tools that allow kids to get transaction alerts, check their balances, all while the parents can oversee all of their children's activity. As a matter of fact, the parents' apps will also be notified when their child spends money, allowing them functional control over their child's account. Parents also have the ability to set a regular allowance, maybe saving options, spending limits, set financial goals and tasks. And the plan is from Revolut that even more options are gonna be added by the end of 2020. So Revolut Junior just adds to the overall robustness of this money managing app from Revolut. So as you can see, the Revolut Wallet app is a pretty robust app and you can do a lot with it. And it, again, if you're if you're a person who sends a lot of money, who has family in different countries, perhaps that kind of thing, this is a great option to be able to send money with minimal fees and in the native currency that they may need. Not to mention, again, if you do the platinum or metal card version of the Revolut app, you can access some of the top cryptocurrencies, which is amazing because you'll be able to buy and I would assume pull them out of there. I haven't done it yet, but we will do it in the future. So in a nutshell, the Revolut app might be just what you're looking for to be able to bank right on your phone without the need for a bank, both in fiat and cryptocurrency. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. 
We hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, we'd really appreciate it if you would share this video with someone that might get benefit from it. And if you haven't already done so, make sure you click that subscribe button and tick that bell icon. And again, don't forget you have to hit all after you tip the bell icon so you can receive all the great information that we're putting out here about the crypto space. Again, we'd like to thank you for joining us here today at Crypto Coin Mindset. We hope you have a great day and take care. Oh, by the way, I promised way back in the beginning of this video that I would give you some information about how you can make passive income in the crypto space. I didn't forget, here's how you can do it. There are two video playlists showing up right now on your screen. One is for Gandhiji and the index.io cryptocurrency exchange. You can make a passive income by holding the IND tokens while people use the index.io exchange. Watch the videos I've created on this in this playlist and it'll give you a step-by-step -step exactly how to do it. And if you're looking for passive income within the Forex market that you get paid out in Bitcoin, Cash FX is for you. This has been, even in these tumultuous times, a consistent passive income source. I suggest very highly you check out Cash FX. So click either of those links and stay tuned for our next video. We got more coming to you soon.